Hey y'all, I made a new Nintendo Labo thing. I made a little ghost hunting game for kids, so what I have here on the screen is a radar that shows the ghosts on the left, and an indicator for whether or not a ghost is a friend on the right. I also have um, this instrument here that detects the ghosts, like, right now it's picking up some ghostly activity here, and oh, there's a ghost, I think they want to be our friend, right? Yeah, they do. Uh, so let's try and find another one. Uh, there's another ghost in the area around here somewhere. Eh, there they are. Uh, so we can shoot the friend rays at them. And they're our friend too. So, uh oh, looks like we're still sensing some paranormal being. Um, there they are. This one's a little less friendly than the others. But now they're our friend too. So let's get out of here. There's a lot of spooky ghosts around here. So this is the schematic for the radar. It's pretty simple. On the left, I have a bullseye on an IR marker detector that uh, triggers the alarm and the vibration. And on the right, I have the light and sound triggered by a counter so you can set the friend points of a ghost by pushing buttons, making it take less or more hits to make the ghost into a friend. So yeah, that was the ghost radar game I made for my cousin's baby supply. So what I'm gonna do is put more reflective tape ghosts like this one around the house and like give one of them the radar and give the other one the sensor so they can hunt ghosts together. Uh, so what happens is when the counter hits 10, there we go, uh, it, the star lights up, that indicating that the ghost is now your friend. So the counter can be dropped down by using the either the X button or by using the any of the buttons on the right joycon or left joycon, which I didn't show in the schematic, but you can put it all in, and which I'm going to be carrying around, just like following them, manually resetting it. So why I chose to do that is so you can either set the ghost's hit points, well, friend points, to either 10, like that, or you could just hit the X button and like set it to like 4 or something. See? Nice and easy. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I really enjoyed making this. I also enjoyed making the video, so leave any questions or comments in the, in the comments. <laughs> and don't forget to like. Uh, thanks guys!